Hey, I'm Richard Kavanagh, Rodney Wayne's Creative Director, and over the next couple of minutes I want to show you how to recreate the hair look from the Grazia shoot in Tokyo, where we created that effortlessly editorial wispy texture in the hair, and I'm going to show you how you can try on a fringe with no commitment. Start with some sea salt spray. Throw your head upside down and give it a generous mist through. Step two, dry shampoo. Repeat the process. Step three, full heat and full speed. Step four, a curling wand. Take the wand in your right hand and come up and over your head like so. Wrap the hair around, allowing it to twist. And you're gonna hold that for approximately five to 10 seconds. Just relax the tension and slide that out. It's the twist in the hair as you wrap it around the iron that stops it from going into one of those classic kind of barrel curls. Repeat that on the other side and uh, remember not to have too much tension because you don't want to drag the curls out while it's still hot. When you finish putting the texture in, you're ready for the fringe. Looks lovely. Well, it's quite nice on me, <laughs> actually. Right, hang on to that. Comb with a tail some little bobby pins. Take a section that's a little bit smaller than the fringe that you would cut. So it's a triangle shape. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Yeah. Because if you were going to cut a fringe, you'd probably come out to about this wide here, like kind of in line with the outside corner of the eyes. Yeah. But for this, we're going to go like in line with the center of the eyes. Give it a little twist like so. Pin it flat to your head. One one way, and then one the other way. And then with this little tail back here, you just comb it back and evenly distribute it. So now you've got a little base there pinned down and that's what you're going to pin your fringe to. Now you've got little pop clips on the back here. And then press down, pop, and pop one on the other side. Give it a little brush through to blend it all in. Here's a little trick to keep your fringe sitting flat and to make it look more natural. Take a little French pin, catch a little bit of hair, bend it back on itself and push it through. Effortless editorial texture and a no commitment fringe.